the Redback Weekly Timer, which can activate a bell or music. It uh, uses uh, MP3 music, though within the folder you can have uh, lots of music and it will shuffle the music when activated. Uh, there are 50 events, so if an event is, let's say you set up, uh, the, the bell to go off at 9 o'clock in the morning for 10 seconds, uh, Monday to Friday, that's one event. Maybe you're in a factory and you want uh, a bell to go off at uh, 12 o'clock, uh, but only on Tuesdays and Thursdays. That's one event. Now you have 50 events available within the unit. It also has uh, evacuation and alert tones built into the unit, into the unit which are uh, based on the Australian standard tones, by the way. Australian made, 10 year warranty. So this is the front panel on our uh, Redback weekly timer. And just over here you can see there's an alert and an evac button which are covered with, uh, with flip, flip covers. Uh, a bell button and the cancel button is to cancel the alert or the evac. has an isolate button to isolate the timer so nothing will, will go off. Menu button if you want to access the menu. And uh, these buttons here are for setting the, uh, the clock and the day, just like a clock radio. The screen here will just display the, the next event that's going to, um, going to activate. And the SD card on the front here is uh, for easy access, so you can easily change your music or change the bell in the library, um, whatever you like. Okay, so this is the rear of our weekly timer. You can see the uh, mains input here is 24 volt D DC, it comes with a plug pack. It also has a 24 volt DC backup for the battery. So if the power goes off, the unit will still operate. You can activate your alert, evac and bell buttons remotely via this terminal here. Uh, it's also available via an RJ45 connection here via CAT6. These are 24 volt switched outputs so if you activate the alert or the evac it will automatically activate 24 volts out here. So you might use that say to activate a, uh, a strobe. Has a battery backup here as well, so you just switch it on so uh, your timer remains correct even if the power goes out. Uh, these are individual level controls so you can act all the uh, alert, evac, bell, whatever it is, you can adjust all those levels independently. And this is a uh, just standard RCA output for connection to your existing amplifier.